Amazon received over 200 applications for its second headquarters, Kaspersky Labs is opening up its software to third-party review, and the Pixel 2 is already running into problems with its LED display. It's all the tech news that's popular right now. Welcome to Hashtag Trending. It's Tuesday, October 24th, and I'm Mandy Kovacs. From Facebook, Amazon revealed that it received 238 proposals from cities and regions across North America to host its second headquarters. The company announced it would be opening up a second location in addition to its Seattle headquarters just a few weeks ago, and competition for the $5 billion project has been intense. While Amazon didn't disclose any of the bidders, Canadian cities like Toronto, Ottawa, and Calgary have been vocal about their interest, as the project is expected to generate 50,000 high-paying jobs over 20 years. Amazon's wish list includes includes the availability of talent, transportation options, a good cultural fit, a metro area of more than 1 million people, tax incentives, and the possibility of moving in as early as 2019. It expects to choose a winner in 2018. From Reddit, Kaspersky Labs has announced it will be asking independent parties to review the security of its antivirus software as a way to overcome mistrust and establish its commitment to protecting people around the world. The Moscow-based cybersecurity giant says it will submit the source code of its software and future product updates to a wide range of computer security experts and government officials for review, starting in the first quarter of next year. The U.S. government is not happy about this, however, citing concerns over Kremlin influence and hijacking by Russian spies, and that this move could jeopardize national security. Kaspersky has responded, saying that this could help alleviate concerns about future security gaps. And last but not least from Google, the company's newly released Pixel 2 XL smartphone is already having problems with its display. Despite being out for only two weeks, some devices have reportedly experienced burn-in on their LED screens, which is when images on the screen linger despite being turned off. Specifically, there have been complaints of image retention around the navigation bar, even after the phone is locked. Google has issued a statement saying it's investigating, but there's been no action so far. Our very own Alex Radu is currently reviewing the Pixel 2 XL, and he hasn't had any issues with burn-in yet, but we'll keep you updated. That's what's trending today. Hashtag Trending is produced by IT World Canada. If you're a subscriber and you enjoy Hashtag Trending, please give us a review on Apple Podcasts, Amazon, or wherever else you get your podcasts from. Once again, I'm Mandy Kovacs.